Hey beauty, today I'm going to be talking Amazon basics. I have been collecting basics from Amazon for years now, so we have a lot to talk about. Grab a coffee, grab some wine, grab a little snack. I've got some iced coffee in my brewmate here. Get comfortable, let's have a little girl time. <laughs> if you are new to my channel, my name is Deandra and I post lots of affordable fashion content. Lots of Walmart, lots of Amazon. I also do DIY beauty like highlights and haircuts and all that fun stuff. So if you enjoy that kind of thing, hit the subscribe button down below and let's get started with this Amazon Summer Basics video. Cheers. I wanted to start off with this little tube top three pack. The tube top is gonna be very trendy in the next few seasons, especially as we see Y2K fashion just kind of blow up. This one is a more trendy color. I really appreciate that with the black and the white one. These are super cute and stretchy up at the top. They have the ruching right here and they are sort of like a long line crop top. Like it's longer than a crop top, but it's not a full length top. I am gonna get so many uses out of all of these. It does actually have an inside lining where it'll keep your strapless bra up, which I really appreciate. All around, this was a great buy. I love buying multi-packs from Amazon. It really is the best bang for your buck, especially if you are stocking up on new basics. Speaking of multi-packs, I've had this one for years. It was a multi-pack of four colors. I'm trying to remember. It was this olive color, a white, a black, and like a mushroomy color, which I don't wear that one as much. I get questions about this tank top every single time I wear it. It is so comfortable, a stretchy cotton, not see-through, and it has a very flattering cut in the shoulders and the neckline. I really love them and they still look really good. Even the white one, and I wear that one all the time, so definitely recommend these. I just recently purchased this two pack of crisscross little workout style tank tops. I've honestly been reaching for this one the most out of all my tanks because it does have a built-in padded bra, which is just so amazing. You guys know that I love my classy network basics because all of them have a built-in bra. If you are just wanting to grab something from Amazon, this is a great option. I love the crisscross in the back. You can wear this to work out in. You can wear this underneath a button up or even dress it up with a pair of jeans and cute heels I think would be cute. So lots of ways to wear and I love that it comes in a black and a white. Another one of my newer basics I bought in a trendy color but it's quickly become one of my best selling pieces so lots of y'all are loving this one it is double lined and it's seamless on the bottom so it's not going to cut you off or anything like that it's a very flattering fit and another piece that you can style up or down very very stretchy and comfortable i just pulled this one from the laundry it's a little wrinkled and kind of a little dingy i'm not gonna lie because i've had it for years and years now that i'm like actually inspecting this and looking at this, I'm definitely going back for another set because it's one of my most reached for tank top bodysuits. I love the more thin straps on this. It came with a black and a white, and it does also have a double lining. The bottoms do have a snap open, which I appreciate. This one's a little dirty. I was wearing it the other day, and Ellie, I think, got yogurt on me, but I really like this high neck tank top. Again, it's that flattering cut right here in your shoulder. 
it fits really nice and I like that it's sort of like a straight cut right here on the neckline I don't know it just gives it something different this one is a stretchy cotton fabric very very soft does have buttons on the bottom which again I appreciate one tank top you've probably seen before it is one of Amazon's top selling pieces for good reason it's double lined and it's super thick super stretchy very flattering it also has the buttons on the bottom I have seen an updated one that is a crop top cute flattering can't go wrong with it I just recently got this in I probably should have steamed it but I really love this because it is a more fancy style basic you could even dress this down with some cut off shorts and cute little sandals if you wanted but you could totally dress this one up you can also layer it under blazers for office wear if you're needing something like that date night you can wear this this one is by amazon the drop and i ordered a small because the drop tanks do tend to run a little big i like that it has the adjustable straps and the cowl neck i love this i think it's gorgeous it's a nice satin fabric and it's got a really cute fit i think i got this one last year but i got so much use out of it this is a top that will be in my closet forever it's sort of see-through but I would just wear a nude bra and it really wasn't that big of a deal you could totally wear this as a swimsuit cover up you can wear this day to day with some cute little shorts I like that this is longer it does have a little side slit on the side I tend to tuck this one in just because it is more of like a flowy loose fit this bodysuit t-shirt this one's actually by daily ritual which is a Amazon in-house fashion brand the the fabric is lightweight and super super stretchy I love the crew neck cut in this and the cute little cap style short sleeves I just think it's so flattering it is also a full coverage bottom it does have the buttons on the bodysuit let's talk denim shorts I recently did just place a try before you buy order from Amazon because none of my jean shorts fit me right now which is okay I can always buy a new pair that do fit me, which is what I did. And I went with Levi's because Amazon does run like random specials on their Levi's. My best friend was telling me about the rib cage jeans and how much she loved them. And then like three days later, they were on deal for 30 bucks. I wanted to try out the shorts too. I picked out the rib cage premium shorts. I liked how long these were. There's a good amount of short in between the pockets and the end. I wanted something that was a lighter wash and just basic. I really like how high-waisted these are and the fact that they are a button fly. The premium denim from Levi's is so soft. I want to say that that's what makes it premium. These I just looked today. They are on deal today for $34. They are the 501 shorts. The biggest difference that I noticed in these shorts is that the fabric is a little bit more stiff than the premium ones, but as I wear them, they get more soft, so I don't mind that. And for basically half the price, they have a very similar fit. They do also have a button fly. I can't decide between the two. I'm not sure if I wanna splurge or not. I really like both of them, honestly. I wanted to try their high-rise mom shorts because online they had kind of a unique fit where they flared out away from the model's legs. I thought that was kind of cute. I went with the black pair. I actually really like this fit because I feel like this fit is one that you can wear with heels. Sometimes I do avoid heels with denim shorts because it doesn't always look right to me, 
but when it's cut like this that's slightly different it makes sense in my head I went with the size 30 on these as well and I think they are so cute I definitely needed a white pair but I wasn't finding any Levi's ones came across these the drop version and I thought they were so cute I do actually have another cream pair of the drop shorts from a couple years ago and they were stretchy and really comfortable one of my go-to shorts those are sold out but these are still available it's probably because these are the updated version the pockets do have some distress I went with a 29 in these the drop does run a little bit big for me and the 29 fit perfect these actually also have a button fly I don't know why but I feel like button flies are just so much more flattering if you're a thrifter and you like to DIY you can totally go to the thrift store and look for your waist size even in the little boys or the men's section is what I do because the little boys sizes are by waist sizes as well so I've bought size 28 from the men's and the kids section and just cut them off where I wanted them that's another option too if you are wanting to thrift and do a little DIY. My best friend put me on these ribcage straight ankle jeans and they are so good. They fit very similar to the Walmart $11 jeans so if you're wanting those and can't find them it really is worth it to spend like I don't know let's say $15 more for these because they are stretchy where the Walmart ones are not I really love this color for the summertime they are the perfect length for me which I am 5'1 I am petite and I appreciate not having to cut off the bottom of the jeans I can wear them with sandals but I can also wear them with heels I like the button fly detail I did order a size 29 in these whereas the shorts I ordered a 30 I do like to size up typically in shorts because I like a little extra room, but the 29 fits me to a T perfect. Let's talk about sets. I think I want to start off with this one. It is a flowy top shorts kind of set. I really, really like this color. I'm kind of thinking about going back for maybe a black one. I know that the Target set like this is very popular. I'm just more of an Amazon Prime kind of girl, honestly. So I went with this one. I love how light and flowy the fabric on these are. It has a pocket and a drawstring waist. The buttons are a contrasting white which I think is so cute I can pair it with a white handbag and some white slides you're gonna be seeing sets like these all over the place and honestly they're the best thing ever I could probably wear a set like this every day of my life and be a-okay with it I actually ended up getting this set last year and it's a little ribbed summer sweater set. It is a one shoulder. Again, you can wear this as a cover up. You can wear this with cute little wedges. You can also just throw it on with some slides and wear it around the house. It's super comfortable, very soft, a ribbed knit fabric. The shorts are a drawstring. I really like this. It's such high quality. Again, I've had it since last year and there's no snagging on it. I have dogs that jump too, so the fact that there's not a snag on this knit fabric speaks volumes of the quality so I went with a medium I have another two pack option I went with the cream in the brown in this little biker shorts sports bra set I really like these to wear underneath a button-up top even just throwing an oversized t-shirt over top of these and you know they're a great basic for summer they're super super stretchy and I really enjoy these. I like that the biker shorts are slightly longer, but not too long because I am petite and when they're too long, it like goes to my knees and it's just not flattering on me. A pair of shorts that I will probably have forever are these little ruffle linen style. I've had these since last year. I also have a tan pair floating around the house, probably in the laundry somewhere. They're so comfortable. They're a go-to when I want to look, you know, dressed up and put together. 
but also be comfortable and cool in the hot Texas summer. I like that the drawstring is on the inside of these because it doesn't really take away from the waistline. These are a must have in my opinion. Another pair that I really like is this little ruffle waistband style. These are just a great go to again when I want to look put together but also be very comfortable. The ruffle gives an extra little cutesy element. I like the little bow in the front. This one does also have pockets and the fabric is super soft. The waistband is super stretchy. These are very lightweight and comfortable. How cute is this outfit with the knit top? You could even switch it to the strapless little tube top with the tan. Like there's so many outfit options here. Little daily ritual dress that I really love is this t-shirt maxi dress. I really like that it has a slit on one side, nothing too dramatic or anything like that. The fabric is super soft and stretchy. It's very, very comfortable. Another one of those everyday type of dresses that you could also dress up and wear out if you wanted. But again, this is something that I would have in my closet for years and years. Another one of my most worn dresses from last year this is by the brand Wild Meadow, and it has this really cute low back bar style detail. Again, the fabric is super lightweight and so, so soft. This one does also have a slit on the bottom. It's a great vacation piece. It's a great throw on and go kind of piece. I like that the neckline is just straight across. I think that's a cute little detail. Another one of my favorite dresses is this little tank top side tie dress. It's a very, very flattering. I like the scoop in the front and in the back. The side tie is adjustable however you want it. And I like the tulip style opening. Very cute for the summertime, easy breezy, but you can also dress this up. Either way you do it, it's a great basic that is very, very flattering. I just got this daily ritual little racerback tank maxi dress in, but I wanna mention it because inside is so incredibly soft. You can see it right there. I'm not sure how hot this is gonna be. It doesn't feel like super heavy it just feels really soft on the inside the outside is very soft as well it does also have a slit on the bottom it doesn't go super high or anything probably like calf length and the fabric is again super stretchy and very very soft like I can't get over how soft the inside of this dress is. It does come in solid colors as well but I have a whole bunch of solid color tank dresses that I wanted a little print in my life. Oh, I almost forgot to talk about this button up. I'm still waiting on my white one. I thought it was gonna come in today, but it didn't. So I'll include a picture right here. It is by the Amazon brand. I like that that one has a three quarter sleeves, but I really like this one. It's a great layering piece for the summer. You can throw this over a swimsuit, like that zebra print swimsuit would look so cute underneath this with my black aviators. I could also wear this with my denim shorts and white tube top or tank top or whatever. You can definitely get this one in a basic color like a white and a black, but I do like this trendy color paired with a bunch of basics because we know that color is on trend for summer 2022 and I'm just someone who loves colors. It is a super lightweight fabric. I really like the fit of this. I ordered my regular size and it does have a nice oversized fit. It's 100% cotton and it's a lightweight cotton too. So I appreciate that because summers are hot and I don't typically do layers, but I think I might be able to layer this one. Moving in to shoes. These are my best selling shoes from Amazon last summer. They're a great basic. I haven't even bothered buying new wedges for this year because they held up really well. I wore them all the time. The back is actually stretchy. You can wear it like this or you can switch it and wear it like this with no back. It's very comfortable both ways. 
I really like the stitching on the outside. These I want to say are a Steve Madden dupe. They did end up coming out with more colors in this style for this year. You really can't go wrong with a nude pair of wedges. Since I'm talking about heels first, let's just talk about these two strap the drop heels you guys know i love these i have them in every color this nude pair is the first pair that i ever bought for myself and they are a faux suede but i also have them in the clear two strap the black alligator nude and gold studs they have white ones they have gold ones they have the black studs they have like 50 different options i'm telling you i get lots of use out of every single one of them they're very comfortable highly rated and another one of my top selling shoes and the heel isn't that high either it's very wearable if you are someone who wants something a little bit more casual but still with a heel that's slightly lower I really love these they are by Amazon essentials and this one does come in other color options I actually saw my best friend wearing the snakeskin ones and they were really cute. She just paired it with a black tank and some cute little jeans. They looked so good. So totally recommend these as well. Another pair that I've had for, I think since last year, the soles are very cushiony and they're just very comfortable. These are not from Amazon. They are from Just Fab. I will link these exact ones if you are wanting these exact ones, but I have seen a lot of clear heels on Amazon. I've seen clear wedges, clear kitten heels, clear high heels, clear strappy heels, lots of clear options. I just wanted to mention a clear shoe because they're very basic. They go with everything. I don't see clear heels going anywhere for a while, so if you're thinking about it, do it. Don't hesitate on the clear heels. I did recently get these two strap flats in and I really like these. They are very cushiony and they're super flattering on my feet. They were a great price on Amazon. Actually, I didn't have a nude basic shoe like this. I do have these gold flip flops. These are by Amazon Essentials, but I have seen some like this at Target before. And I've also seen other Amazon brands carry these, but these from Amazon are super affordable. I think they were like $12. I'm not huge on flip-flops and I don't wear them everywhere, but if you are wanting more of an elevated flip-flop to wear to the pool or just around the house or like quickly to run and grab groceries or whatever, these are a great option because they're not just like your plastic flip-flops they're leather so they look just a little bit nicer and they were still super affordable so I totally recommend a leather style of flip-flops I did also want to mention this woven bag I really love this bag I want to say I just mentioned it in another Amazon video but I get questions on it all the time and it's a summer basic that I will have forever I will take this on all of my beach vacations I just think it is the cutest little summer bag and this year they did release it in new colors so if you are wanting a a uh, tan woven bag that's kind of like a tote and it's not one of those round woven ones i think this is really cute with the wood handles and it was also very affordable but it does actually open up and hold quite a bit like i could fit a swim towel some sunscreen sunglasses and my phone even like a little mini speaker in here so i have a lot of sunglasses but i feel like the it sunglasses from amazon this year are gonna be these gold ones these are a designer inspired style and they're just so cute i've seen a lot of influencers talking about these i'm sure all of y'all have the pointy cat eye sunglasses from amazon by now so i'm not even going to talk about those even though those are a staple piece i wanted to showcase these they're very very high quality you also can't go wrong with an aviator fade style these are another classic 
that you will probably have forever. These are the sunglasses that stay in my car in case I forget sunglasses because they just go with everything. Thanks for hanging out today. I hope that you enjoyed all of my Amazon finds. I've been shopping on Amazon for years and years and years and I only wanted to show you all the best of the best. So I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so, so much for watching and I'll see y'all next time. Bye-bye.